ahead to the extra dotty FBI Cup semi finals. It's a big one, it's Shamrock Rovers, it's a Dublin derby, it's huge. What are your emotions going into this game? Just excitement, really. You know, we obviously we are we are, everybody knows and everybody's talking about how big of a game it is. You know, semi final of a cup against your biggest rival. So, yeah, excitement. And well, how's, how's the squad looking ahead of the game? Is there a lot of uh, motivation to, especially with it being at Daily as well? Yeah, just th these games in general. You know, regardless of the title of being a cup game, I think you know there's probably a lot more motivation in these games and especially from the fans and because of everything that goes with it. So yeah, uh, squad's looking forward to. It. Going back to last year, got to the semi-finals, it was obviously the replay. How much of last year is still on the mind and is there any, is, is there any motivation up there to try and arrest those memories? Yeah, obviously, you know, it was, a, it, was, it, was, it was very disappointing last year to go out the way we did and especially how close we came in Daily Mount and they get the penalty, you know. Uh, but we haven't really thought about it or even talked about it this week and about last year. We're just looking forward to Friday and hopefully that we can play well and sh give a good, good account to ourselves and get the result. The season has gone tremendously well, really. There was a lot of doubters at the start of the season about the unions because the amount of the influx of players which have come in. Keith Long got his recruitment right, and you're, you're obviously one of the oldest statesmen there. How have you seen the younger players progress this year? Yeah, it's, it's been great, really. You know, obviously, we, you know, last, last year in the off season, Keith lost a lot of important players. and big rebuild went on, and we've done, done unbelievably well this year with what he's got. And, Obviously, you say he's got his recruitment right. He's brought in like some very, very talented young lads, and it's great to see them play and play with no fear. It's good. And during your time at Bohemians, how have you seen that support, that community that we see at Daily Mount now, which is so alive, and the work which has gone on behind the scenes in the community? How much do you, have you seen that progress? Yeah, well, I've been there a long time, and from the first year I've come, you know, it's it's since the lads behind the scenes, scenes do an unbelievable job, and. Obviously, it's getting bigger and bigger every year. Like you come to Daily Mount, it could be you know we're sold out nearly every week, which is great. And obviously, the, the scenes last weekend on, on Saturday, the queues going around the block. It's it's something yeah. we don't obviously see very much in the SSC recently. But how much hope does that give you that, that the club can continue its progress? Yeah, hopefully they can. You know, it's, it'd be great to see that outside, like the whole league. Really, you know, that's what we want to do. We want the league to be built up, but. You know, the lads behind the scenes at Bowles are doing an unbelievable job and it's great that, they, that we're getting this support and hopefully we can give them something to scream about on Friday night. And just finally, we're obviously sat here at the Aviva Stadium, the final is scheduled for Sunday, November the 3rd. How much do you want to be sat here on that day? Yeah, obviously, you know, it's, it's a massive day, a massive occasion for everybody, you know, family and friends, everything. So, uh, yeah, look, we just have to go into Friday and look after Friday, hopefully, first, and then we can start dreaming about that. Good luck there. Cheers.